Hello friends, in this video we will understand the 5 common mistake every Flutter developer do and how we can avoid this mistake to become the beginner to pro level developer. Folder structure is the main mistake which every developer do. They put all the files inside the single folder. Like in this image you can see we have the lift folder inside that we have all the files. In this way these files are not in the organized manner and they get lot of difficulties in case they have to modify any file or have to look for any code in any specific file. So the solution for this is to always create a module wise folder structure like this way we have the API folder. There we have the API service files then we have the pages folder. Inside that we have two pages that is customer page and the order page. Then we have the utils folder inside that we have the utils files. Then we have the wizard folder inside that we can put all the wizards over there like this way we put order underscore item underscore wizard dot dot file. The second most common mistake every developer do is by creating a long lines of code like this way in a single page or in a single method. In that way our code is not in a readable manner and it is difficult for any new developer to understand the code. Best solution for this is to divide our code into the chunks of code in the separate wizard file or in a small private matter like this way we did. The third most common mistake is so much dependency on the third party plugins. Sometimes plugins get discontinued or sometimes version upgradation create the issue. So we have to try to minimize the use of third party package as much as we can or instead we can create our own packages or we can create the utilities files instead of dependent on the third party plugins. Like here you can see we have lot of dependency on the third party packages but what we have to do we have to use the minimum number of packages. Fourth most common mistake we as a developer always do that is the lack of comments in the code because we are so much in the pressure to complete the project or we are in hurry to start a new project. So the solution for this is to we should always follow the practice to write a proper comments into our project. So it will be beneficial for us also in the future in case we shift to another project but when we come back after long term we can just read all the comments and we can understand what is going in the project. It will be beneficial for us also. Fifth and the last most common mistake every developer do is not test the application in the most latest or in the old version of the Android or iOS. The result will be the application is not workable for most of the user because of the OS version not compatible with mobile application. Simple solution for this is to download almost all the version of SDK or to test our application. So it will help us to have a better application support for almost all that version because it is not possible to purchase each and every device. So it is better to download all the SDKs and we can test our application over there. So these are the five most common mistakes we as a developer always do. So I hope you like the video. Don't forget to subscribe to our channel, like, comment, share and please let me know if you like this video. If you need these types of video and let me know. I will try to make these types of video in future also. So thank you for watching the video.